Hello, I am Yet4455, and welcome back to Zoo Tycoon 2. All right, we are playing the African Diversity Zoo, and our current goal is to get eight different species of African animals so that we can get another $40,000 grant. So, uh, yeah, I think we have six. I think we're almost there. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, we're at six, so we need to get two more. Now, what's going to be harder about this is that we need to get our star ratings up so we can get some more African animals. Because right now, we don't have many to choose from. Ah, there we go. Nile monitor. That's always a good. Uh, we already have camels. Um, so, right. So, we got to get our zoo rating up. Um, the best way to do that, of course, is to we get our number of animals and number of species up. As well as get our guest happiness up. But we're, we're working on it. So let's just keep this thing running. Um, guest happiness I think is fine. Like I'm not seeing any glaring red anywhere. So we just got to keep an eye on it. And the camels are happy. Right. Um, species. Let's see. This Nile monitor. Uh, you are wetlands. I think you're a predator, though, so I'm not sure if I w actually want to put you in here. But what I could do is let's clear this area. I think I'll make a small exhibit for you here. Let's expand this path out just to the end here. Now, this doesn't have to be too big. So, let's see here. We could go with the small fence. And yeah, I think I'm only going to make it about this size. Let's... Uh, so, how big is that? 975. Okay. There. Make it a nice little square. There we are. Oops. Go back. I need to add some gates. Throw a gate there and a gate there. And we'll make this wetland. So I go a little bit outside the fence, but that's alright. There we are. Add some trees. Maybe a little watering hole. There. All right, and they like fish. I'll put a water dish in there as well, just in case they need it. Oh, and they like this, uh, the heat lamp. I think that'll be fine. Uh, bushes. Yeah, we'll throw some logs in there. Maybe a bush or two. There we are. And then we'll throw one of each gender in there. Perfect. Oh, and then we get the Ibex right away. Perfect. So that's, that is going to be both of our animals right off the bat. So good. Yeah, we got a couple Nile monitors in there. I put them in there just in case they're predators and like to eat the other animals. Um, crocodiles are going to get their own in here. Go ahead and sell that. Uh, water buffalo is now pregnant. That's always good. Wait a minute. Weren't they pregnant already? Or, oh. It was the bongos. That's right. The bongo was pregnant. That's right. Alright, and you are... Oh. You are not African. You are alpine. Well, that's unfortunate. And you're a little too much. Um, penguins are cool. Um... I'll think about penguins. It might be penguins. If I could get some animals released to the wild, that would be great. And you know, if I ever get the Thompson Gazelles back, I think I'm just going to plop a few down and then release them right away. I've got all these extinct animals. I can't use those yet. Not until the later mission, at least. Do, do, do. So, yeah, this is looking good. All 
Yeah, we got this extended out. I could move this down a little bit. Maybe right about there. That'll work. Thompson's gazelle is going to give birth. That's good because that's another animal number that I can use. Alright, let's see. Let's get these. Yep, more extinct. Come on. All right, let's just let's just try to do them all and see what happens. Cuz I am thinking about these. I do like those animals at least. You know, give us some more to work with. But we'll we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Alright, let's see, uh, we don't need that, not that, not that. Horned Onyx, I think that's what I was looking for, that Horned Onyx. We already have the Giraffe. Uh, we're not going to use the Merlin. Marlin? Marlin. Alright, let's see, where are you? You're desert, right? Perfect. So we'll plop down one of each type there perfect yep uh all right we have uh eight different species now so they have given us the forty thousand dollars and we have been hired to build the zoo wait so yeah now i think i just got to get up to the 14 species yep so i gotta get six more and i'm up to level two in the zoo which is good so now I just need to try to get different types. Uh, what are you? Ah, you are scrub. So you can be used for one of my optional ones. And I think I'm going to put the scrub right over here. But man, there are a lot of money. 5000 apiece. There's an ostrich. That would work. And what are you? You're the Ibex. Um, tapers are Central America. Up, oh, African Spurred Tortoise. That will work. Um, we already have Flamingos, but they're cheap, right? Oh, 2,000. Eh, cheapish. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to plop down a common pea file right there. And we're just going to release it to the wild right away. Right away. Now, do I have any bigger bathrooms? And the answer to that is yes. So we're going to sell you. We're going to put this bigger bathroom down for people. As soon as they get out of the way. As soon as they get out of the way. There we go. Perfect. So we got a larger bathroom there. Which should help improve the flow of that. Um, people's fun... So, yeah, I think it's time we put this discovery kiosk down. Quite possibly. I think I'll move this. Just off to the side here. And I think I'm going to put the discovery kiosk right there. Yeah. Something like that'll do. And then we'll just add a couple more dirt paths there. And just to uh, create the illusion, put it there, kind of keep everything symmetrical. Perfect. Alright, and then we got this, um, this tortoise here that we could plop one of each in. Um, I'm not sure about your food, though. Um, food. Um, you like grass or lettuce? I think grass will be fine. And we'll throw lettuce over on this side. I think you want a heat lamp. But, you know, it's, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Um, I could use this reptile pool, which is always a possibility. I think they'll be fine for now. Did you get any new enrichment items? Not particularly. Um, we'll just keep an eye on you. If your enrichment starts to go, we'll give you a heat lamp. 
But yeah, we'll just keep an eye on you. All right. Um, the ostrich, I believe, is a lot of money. So yeah, that one I think I'm not going to use. Alpaca is not. Actually, they were. Hmm. Teach me to click off right away. The attics is. The jaguar is not, though. So yeah, I am getting a lot more animals to choose from. Greater Flamingo is going to lay an egg. That's good. The attics. Did, it, did I already place an attics? No, you're the onyx. Okay, I think I will place an attics. Plus, they're critically endangered, so that's always always nice to have in the zoo. Um, I do have... I'll, I'll plop another thing of grass down just to help out a bit. So I have the attics. I don't need sea lions. Not this manatee. Not whatever that thing was. Right, what are you angry about? Fun. Right, you're looking at the globe statue, so you should be taking care of your fun at the moment. How much did that... Yep, that took care of a big chunk. Good. Good, good, good. Everything's moving along here. I could probably add a few more, like, snack carts around. Could be something I do. I'm surprised I haven't got... All right, you're from Central America. I'm surprised I haven't got um, the crocodiles yet. Where do you have bongos? Up oh, there's the gemstock. Yeah, you're alpine. You're South America. Guests do love my zoo. That is always a good sign. That, that means I'm in the right direction. Yeah, guest happiness is starting is on the rise. Educational habitats are on the rise. Animal happy habitats are up there, and number of animals and number of species are on the rise as well. And I believe I finally got one little release to the wild thing. Which is good. Alright, don't need you, don't need you. Um, I think uh, we'll get rid of the penguin. Eh, it gives me, gives me a type of whale. Hmm. Alright, you are scrub. You are scrub. So you're from Southern Africa. You are kind of in both. So I can combine your exhibits. Um, new object. Oh, cool. Got another star. Um, so we will go ahead and expand out this way. And also the question is, how far did I expand out with this exhibit? Oh, I actually made two. Okay. So I, I'm i probably going to... This one's going to house two animals. So I'm going to make this a little bit bigger than the other one. Probably something like that. And then we'll go ahead and add in the scrubbiness of this. Oh wait, I don't have to. It's already It already is. And you're from the region. Add in a couple of you. Alright, and we do have the, the large troughs now, which is good. So I can just put the big ones out. And then we'll add in the gem stocks. One of each of those. And a salt lick. Perfect. So I don't need the gem stocks. I already have you. I already have you. Galapagos tortoise. Although awesome, are not from this region. So I got that, and I could put this. You know, I, I have enough money. I'll bite the bullet. And there's my two. So there's. Then if we'll get, they'll give us twenty thousand if we could get two different African species from grasslands. That will be something to keep an eye, keep an eye out for. So, like the secretary bird would be one of them. Um, okay, what do you need? I believe everything's this... Oh, you want branches. Which I don't have a large branch thing, so I'll throw a couple branch things in there. 
Um, now I gotta find my zookeeper because I gotta add in that biome. Um, what's wrong with you? Oh, I need an ATM. Okay, I need to start adding ATMs. People are running out of money. So we'll add in an ATM for them so they can give me more money. I'll add one there. Yeah, I think one will work for now. It got really dark all of a sudden here. But uh, that, it's the end of the month. Alright, what else can I add in this zoo? What can I add for like fun and entertainment for guests? This music rock I could add probably in these corners. I think that would be fine. Alright, the bongo's going to give birth. That's always good. Alright, so Pakai. Hmm. Uh, I just think this is a little too small. But I think we need to get like something else going here. So I have the onyx. Uh, you're not part of the right zone. Gives me the penguins again. As much as I like the tortoise. Up, oh, rhinoceros. There we go. At the bongo has given birth. That is always a good sign. People get to see baby animals. Um, I do need to think about maybe some bushes here. I did neglect that. Um, you are the wrong part. Yeah, there's not really African scrub. I mean, this is a North African. So it's not going to work. Especially those are from the southern part. And I forgot to add a gate. And I add it in the wrong place. There we go. There we go. Okay, I got the research for the music rock. I will add music rocks in on either end of the zoo. Probably in these corners. Just to give people um, that are on the either ends something to do. Uh, something's thirsty. Can you not use that? All right, now you're going to drink. Okay. Um, you're not happy about something, and that's because I need something to drink. I'm taking care of that. Don't worry. Um, there's my zookeeper. I needed to add this area. Oh, and look at that. Now I'm a three-star zoo. Which, that is good. Because then it should give me a few more animals to choose from. So, rhinos are expensive, but they are scrub. There's the secretary bird. So, that I can add in. Um, this horse is from, like, Asia or something. Uh, Thompson's gazelle, Paca, I don't need. This I don't need anymore. Buffalo, Komodo dragons, although cool. I think we're going to add in the rhinos. Do I give them their own exhibit? I think the answer to that is yes. Just because uh, rhinos are my favorite animal, so I think they're going to get the preferential treatment here. Just kind of flatten this out a bit. Here we are. Go ahead and kill all of these for the moment. Boom. Alright, now how far out from this road did that second exhibit go? That is the question. Such a smelly exhibit. Yeah, I think I'm going to need like a wandering. All right, so from here, 1540. So I'll just find out where 1540 is right there. Come in one, 
and boom. And let me guess, I picked the wrong fence. Ah, but they need it, so it's fine. They need that particular fence type. Because the other fence, I think they'll just kind of plow right through. Do something like that. And then I think we'll put one of these rhinos in. One of each of these rhinos. Just because I like rhinos. Right, we'll give them some branches. Alright, yeah, I think I'm going to need another zookeeper for that side. Alright, plop in a few th trees. Oh, that's too big of a rock. Rock or two. Yes, I know they can't. We'll go ahead and give them one of these and one of these. Cool. And a donation box. But then I gotta go see what's going on in my desert exhibit because they are all complaining about being thirsty, this, that, and the other thing. So I'm gonna put a donation box. They're set with their food. And I think I'm just going to have a free roaming zookeeper. Oh dear God. Okay, yeah, I should maybe come down here and help out. So yeah, the zookeepers are not keeping up. Fill that up. Fill that up. Clean that. Clean. Get some grooming. Yeah, there is a lot of waste here. So yeah, we'll just kind of help them out a little bit. I mean, there are also animals in here. There we go, that's better. That should help them out quite a bit. And you know what? Two zoo zookeepers. Two free roaming ones. So I'm going to have one assigned to all of them, and then two that can just kind of roam free and help out wherever they are needed. Alright, so I have four that hatched. Oh, yeah, because I did uh, plop down that one and released it right away. That's right. Uh, you're the secretary, bird. You cost $10,000, though. Hmm. Although it'd be nice to have that grassland money. Komodo dragons, no. That, no. That, no. I already have gazelles. Ostriches are quite. A bit expensive. Already have the gem stock. Don't need that. Don't need that. I already have the onyx. So yeah, we're just trying to go through the American beavers are cool. Zebras. I think we already have zebra. Antelope. Your savannah, right? Yeah. See, I'm, I'm trying not to overload the savannah this time because only four animals count in the savannah. I mean, I think I only have two at the moment, so I could add a couple more, but let's, let's try to... Let's try to get a couple more in there. And we'll just see what, what we have going on here. Interesting. Uh, guests love my zoo. Yes, I love the zoo also. I love this game. This game is awesome. For it being an older game, it really does stand up to the test of time. And they're going to do some of their natural sniffing stuff. Uh, the pee files I've been kind of ignoring, and they desperately need their privacy need taken care of. So I am going to go ahead and give you an elevated box. You guys seem to be okay. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So I need two more animals to complete this mission. And you know what? I think we just plop down the two and I think we just beat this. There's a white rhino again. 
I have zebra, right? Like, like I'm not imagining that. Like, zebras exist here. Or maybe they don't. Oh! I, I won the challenge with placing one animal. I guess I lost count of it. Um, cool. So that means I beat it? It says challenge one. Up oh, there it is. Scenario one. Okay, your board of directors are pleased with your efforts. You built a zoo containing 14 different African species. I thought I only counted 12, but if they say it's 14, it's 14. With only four savanna species. Awesome. Congra congratulations on building a zoo that illustrates the diversity of African wildlife. Well, look at that. So, hey, guys, I think uh, this will be the end of this episode. Uh, so if you liked what you watch, please give me a like on the YouTube channel. And also don't forget to subscribe. And it really helps out a lot. And like always, um, follow me on the Facebook, Twitter, and check out my Patreon page. And so, yeah, I am yet 4455. Thank you for watching.